Thanks for checking out the video. This is a very very basic tutorial for beginners on how to create graffiti letters. I will be adding more in-depth videos to this series, but this is the first, so we're starting with the very basics. Graffiti, simply put, is abstract lettering. So the easiest way to start as a beginner is to start with simple letter shapes and work off those to establish your letter shapes and style. Today, we'll work off the letter A. You can see how I use the basic letter A to create my own style of a graffiti letter A. When it comes to most pieces, I start with a sketch or a quick outline, and then a fill in of the same color. Next, I add a clean outline with a strong contrasting color. Black is usually a safe choice. The next step is the drop shadow. With this step, you need to know the basics of lighting in art and where your light source is coming from. This will determine where your drop shadows are and where your highlights will be if you choose to add them. Next comes the highlights. Highlights are usually at the highest point of an object or on the edges where the light is hitting. So usually, the highlights are placed opposite of the drop shadow as they are where the light is hitting the object and the drop shadow is what's cast on the opposite side of where the light is hitting. Highlights are also usually a brighter color than the rest of the piece, white, or lighter version of the fill color work well. This works well with throwies and basic lettering, but when it comes to more detailed pieces or wild styles, there will be multiple highlights and shadows, and they won't just be on one side, which all goes back to knowing the basics of lighting in art. But that's for another video which I'll get around to eventually. I then usually finish my pieces with a final outline, using the fill color works. But, I usually like to use another strong, contrasting color to really catch the eye and complete the piece. There it is, we just turned this into this. A very simple and easy technique for beginners. This technique will work with any letter or number, and you should practice with all letters and numbers. Hit the books, practice, and work your lettering. Thanks for watching. Please let me know if you liked the video, and also comment on what you would like to learn or what you're struggling with, and I'll try my best to help you. Please, don't forget to subscribe, as a newer channel, every like, comment, and subscription mean the world to me. I appreciate it, thank you.